Hi everyone, this is Ali from Little Zen One. Today I'm going to show you how to put on the Diddy Click. The Diddy Click is a half buckle carrier. It has uh, wide wrap straps and a buckle waist. It is fully adjustable, so there's some Velcro on the waistband here, and you can make the carrier wide and enough for a toddler, preschooler, anyone up to 45 pounds. Or you can make it really nice and narrow. You see? So we put really small babies in here, uh, newborn. Today my baby is about four months. I'm just going to make it a tiny bit wider. It's really easy to, to do and you don't have to do this every time. You just um, change it as your baby grows. Okay, so I've just centered it on the, the piece of Velcro. And for a small baby, if you can see on my back, you want to do a higher carry than you may be used to. So I'm going to buckle it up here and then I'll turn the carrier around. If the straps are bothering you, just tuck them in. Also, I want to add that I did just wash it so it might look wrinkly because <laughs> we didn't iron it, but my shirt's wrinkly too, so say lovey. So here's my baby and I'm going to put my baby on my body just where I want him to be. And his arms are going to be up near his face for self-soothing. Now instead of grabbing the straps, you're going to have to take your hand and smooth the carrier up the baby's back. After you've done that, you just place each strap over the corresponding shoulder. You see how I'm spreading it out? So you're going to try and spread it out. And if you notice this seam, it's not too far down. I can kind of move it up a little bit higher. Now at this point, I think you can see in the mirror, but I'll turn around as well. You're going to take your hand flat against your back so you find the opposite strap and then pull away and bring the carrier around to your front. I'll hold the baby and switch sides. You can pull this quite snug. Here you have a choice. With a newborn you can um, go under each leg like this and just tie it at the front or even with an older baby. It's up to you. I like to cross it here at the toggle like that. Loosely I usually do things in a hurry <laughs> and then fix them afterwards. And then you're going to tie a double knot behind your back. Um, sorry, I don't mean a double knot. I mean two half knots. So you can see behind my back, here's one half knot and another half knot. And you're done. And then once you're done the knot, you can take these and just push them down. And it shouldn't be too tight behind the legs. And now you want to adjust the baby. You see his little leg is hanging down. Pull my shirt out, please. <laughs> The little leg is hanging so I'm just gonna take each his, his leg you can do two things you can take each leg and kind of push up and bounce and that should get them to stay or you can take your hands between the panel and the baby's bottom and kind of tilt his pelvis towards you oh he's so cute and snug so it's really easy to do um, you can play around with how uh, much you need to adjust the panel for your baby so if I squeeze this, did you see my baby move up? Because <laughs> so tightening this is kind of counterintuitive, but it shrinks the height of the panel. And then on your back, you want to make sure these are nice and spread. So to do that, you can just reach. It takes a bit of practice. And probably for this video, I'm not doing a great job, but it is what it is. And the nice thing about this carrier, why I really recommend it is you can have three layers of support. So right now I just have one, but let's say I wanted to get three. I'll just take the top edge and pull it up the baby's back. And so I find the top edge under my armpit. Ta-da! <laughs> it's so easy to use. You can see I have three layers. Now this here is the hood. If I fully release these, what I have is a nice full hood. And if baby's sleeping, I like to just do the back. And then you tuck it through here and back there. And now my baby's head is supported, but I still have a line of sight to my baby's face. Now, if you don't want to do that, you can just wear the hood fully down. Sorry for the wrinkles, everyone. <laughs> this carrier usually is really nice and smooth looking. Um, and you can also go like that. And this makes a little kind of neck support pillow. So it's a super comfortable carrier. There is no structured waistband. 
It's just a soft, squishy thing. So if I wanted to go sit down, <laughs> I have a chair, but I'm just showing you. There's no pressure on my on my waist. It's all nice and high. And the weight is all spread out over my back. Okay, if you have any questions, just pop them in the comments and I'll make you another video.